Welcome back, Podskis, or if this is your first time here, we are the Podsan School. We provide you with all the tools you need to plan, produce, launch, and promote a successful podcast. Yes, and so many people are constantly asking, is it possible to podcast for free? The answer is yes, and on today's video, we are going to continue on our journey using the Anchor app. And we're going to show you from start to finish how you can make a podcast episode. We're actually going to make a podcast episode of Tango with Veronica. And we're going to show you not only how you can use the Anchor app, but how you can use the Anchor app on your phone for free, whether it's an Android or an iOS phone with two different people in two different two locations. Different locations. Exciting. We will be giving you some tips along the way to achieve the best audio quality and also the best content. Yes, so make sure you stick around until the end to see the episode in its completion. We're going to do some small edits, we're going to add an intro, we're going to add some music and even some sound effects. I'm excited. This is going to be so fun. But before we move on, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell button to be notified of our weekly video releases. You don't want to miss them. Yes, and if you haven't downloaded your free copy of the podcast, Jumpstart Guide, Guide. You'll find the link in the description below. Just make sure to grab your free copy of that. Okay, what do you say we get to it? Let's get to it. If you're brand new to the Anchor app, you'll want to set up your podcast. Give it a title, give it a description, and put a lot of thought and work into this. Also some cover art. We do have a video that you can find right here. Make sure you check that out. It will help you get started with the Anchor app. But for today's video, we're gonna assume that you've already started with Anchor. So for our experiment today, I'm going to record another podcast episode of Tango with Veronica, but I'm gonna bring a special guest, Studio Steve, so he can share his passion for Tango. But before we start recording, remember that there's a lot of planning that goes into your podcast. Don't forget to do a little bit of market research and competitive research and to develop your idea and see if there's an audience for your idea before we start recording mm -hmm. that. Those are very important steps that you should not ignore. Yes, and we have tons of videos here on our channel that you can see. This one right here will take you through the 11 steps to start a great podcast. And it will help you with finding a topic, finding a title, all of the market research mm -hmm. and finding your niche that goes into having a successful podcast. Yes, we want to set you up for success and we want you to be podcasting for a long time. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's get to recording. So the first thing with Anchor is when you're gonna bring a guest on, you wanna make sure that they have the Anchor app installed on their phone and that they've set up an account with Anchor. Once your guests or your co-hosts have created a free account with Anchor, you are ready to start your recording session. So let's open up our Anchor app. Okay, so now that you're in the Anchor app here, this is your dashboard. This will tell you all sorts of information. At the bottom, you see a thing that says tools. Click on that. Okay, and from this screen, you can press the purple plus, and you'll notice some tabs along the bottom there. There's record, library, interlude, sounds. Go to the record tab, and you'll notice in the middle, it says invite friends to join. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, let me transfer you to another location. Is that okay? Yeah. Let's do it. So now Studio Steve is in another location waiting for my invite. What we need to do now is to open up the Anchor app and then we tap on tools and then we tap again on tools and then on the record screen we tap invite friends. There's a message that pops up. Underneath the message you have another invite friends. And then you can hear there's a tune that sounds while you're waiting to send your invite. That's pretty cute. There's a few options that you can choose to send uh, the invitation link. You can send it through social media. You can send it through text message, or you can just copy the link and send it uh, uh, the way that you want to send it. For this uh, specific example, we're going to use message. And then I look for his contact information. I found it. And then I send the invite. Mm. Ooh, I got a text message. Ooh, I'll press this and join. Now I have the option to join recording right here. I'll go ahead and press that. Hello? 
Hello. Hi, Veronica. We can see here on the screen that he joined. Yes. Hi, Studio Steve. Hi, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. I'm excited. Thanks for inviting me on your podcast. Thank you so much for being here. So we're going to start the interview. Is that okay? Yeah, let's go. Okay. So thank you so much for being here in Tango with Veronica. I know that you have an interesting story to share about how Tango changed your marriage. Could you share that story with us? Yeah, I sure can, Veronica. And thank you for having me. So I was in a rough patch in my marriage, and we were actually... Uh, looking for a counselor, a marriage counselor, and as I was passing the counselor's office, I saw a tango uh, lessons, and I decided to skip the marriage counseling and do tango lessons, and getting into tango and learning how to dance saved my marriage with my wife. And, oh, oops, I screwed up, Veronica. Oh, don't worry, Studio Steve, we'll get to edit that out later. Oh, okay, good. Uh, well, that's the end of my story there, and thank you for having me. Thank you so much for sharing. Okay, well, um, I'll talk to you uh, next time. Sounds, Sounds good. good. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Okay, now that we finished our recording, we press the finish recording button. Oh, and I'll press finish recording on my end. And the okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. Now you'll see in the app that the audio is processing. This will take a couple of minutes to process. The longer your recording, the longer it will take to process. While we're waiting, let's get Studio Steve back up here so he can help me to edit his interview into a full podcast episode. Oh, hey, Veronica. Hi, Studio Steve. That was a lot of fun. Well, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Thank you. So one thing I want to mention that you saw that Veronica and I, <laughs> and I did is we held the phones at a distance from our mouth. That's a good idea to do. And the other thing is we were in sound controlled rooms or rooms that have not a lot of echo or not a lot of reverb going on. That's going to help a lot too. The other thing you can do is to turn the volume of your phone down as much as you can while uh, still being able to hear the person that you're talking with. That will avoid feedback and more echo happening with your voice. But uh, I don't know about you, but I think I'm ready to edit this up and, and get a good podcast episode happening. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, cool. So the first thing we're going to want to do is to trim the audio at the beginning and the end. So to do that, uh, you'll notice it says recording with Studio Steve here. Mm -hmm. We just click on that um, and we add the plus button and it says add to episode and we say yes, add recording to episode. Mm -hmm. So here's the recording with Studio Steve. If I click on the three dots, it gives me some options and one of the options is to trim the start and end point. If I click on that, the phone turns around and now you can play it and listen to where the interview actually started. So if we play, I can kind of guess where it started just by looking at the waveforms. This is probably right here is where Veronica probably asked me. I'm excited. Thanks for inviting me on your podcast. Thank you so much for being here. So we're going to start the interview. Is that okay? Yeah, let's go. So right after that, yeah, let's go. So I'm going to go ahead and trim it all the way up to yeah, let's go because we don't need any of that mm -hmm. first part. And then at the end, um, let's see... You can uh, change the cursor of where to start the play button for sharing without losing the first of the end part. You see that? So here. Okay. Well, um, I'll talk to you uh, next time. Sounds good. Thank okay. you. Bye bye. Now uh, that was our the end of our interview right there. Mm -hmm. We might not even need that much though. Story there, and thank you for having me. Thank you so much for sharing. And that's probably enough right there. That's a good place to end. And then we go there. Now that we have our start and our end selected, we go ahead and press. So thank you so much oh, for I press the play button, but right next to the play button is save. We go ahead and press save. And now we have the trimmed version. And as you can see, it takes some time to process that. It's going to create a new audio file of what we've trimmed. So now if you remember, there was also a time where Studio Steve, the there guest, was a boo -boo. the guest made a boo-boo. Mm -hmm. So let's see if we can get rid of that boo-boo and I'll show you how to do that. Anchor doesn't allow very advanced editing, but it does allow you to take out chunks of time. You'll see here it says edit audio. We click on edit audio. Again, we get to switch to the horizontal view here. We can find the place that I had my boo-boo by pressing play. And as I was passing the counselor's office, I saw a tango uh, lessons and I decided to skip the marriage counseling and do tango lessons. And getting into tango and learning how to dance saved my marriage with my wife. And, oh, oops, I screwed up, Veronica. Oh, don't. So that first part, uh, oh, oops, mm -hmm. with my wife. 
I know it's right about there. So you can see this says split, right? Mm -hmm. So I'll press split once there. Then let's continue to play on. I screwed up, Veronica. Oh, don't worry, Studio Steve. We'll get to edit that out later. Oh, okay, good. Uh, well, <laughs> and right there. So we say split there and our acting was very good there. <laughs> now you'll see I've made two split marks. And if we go ahead and say save, look at what it's done. It's created three files. Mm -hmm. The file in the middle will be the file that I don't want anymore mm -hmm. because that is the file that was in between my two split marks. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, cool. So what we do here is we click on the three dots next to recording two of three and we say delete from episode. Mm -hmm. That doesn't delete it permanently. We can still, by going to tools, we could slide over to our library and we still have that in our library. Mm -hmm. We could access it again if we needed to. So if you make a mistake. If, it make, if you make a mistake, you can go back you to your library and find and, that. Okay. Mm -hmm. But let's press X here in the mm -hmm. left so we can get back to our episode. And now you can see if we were to play through the episode, we would hear a shortened version and we cut out that mistake of our guest making a mistake, which happens all the time. And this is leads us to another point, which is one thing, if you're gonna be using Anchor and recording like this, you wanna have an outline, you wanna have key points. Mm -hmm. If you're gonna have a guest on, you wanna send them talking points beforehand. Uh, you wanna make sure that you're as organized as you can be before recording so that you have a really good episode mm -hmm. because Anchor's not gonna allow you to make a lot of edits. Okay, so now that we're done with that, this episode needs an intro and an outro. It does. So let's go ahead and go back to tools again, and let's have Veronica record an intro. Okay. Okay, so you just press the record button. On the spot. On mm -hmm. the spot, <laughs> yeah. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Tango with Veronica. Tango with Veronica is a podcast about the beautiful dance of tango and how it has changed lives, generations, through generations. Uh, don't forget to follow me on social media. Thank you so much for tuning in. Cool. And, and then that's great for now. We'll go ahead and save. Another thing you could say, and we'll say add recording to episode. The other thing right here is it gives us an option to uh, name this segment. Oh. So if you took a lot of time and you got the perfect intro and you wanted to use that intro every single time on every episode, you wouldn't have to re-record it. You could just go to your library and I can't spell intro and I'll say intro there, add recording <laughs> to episode. So now we see intro has been added to our uh -huh. episode. Uh, another thing you could have said there is today I have a very special guest. Oh yeah. Studio Steve, let's bring him oh, on. Oh, well, can I do it? Yeah, you can do that too. So while this is processing, you're still able to click on tools okay. and start recording again and say today we have a special guest. Oh. Today we have a very special guest, Studio Steve. He's going to share with us his beautiful story of tango and the significance of tango in his life. Uh, thank you, and here's the interview. Perfect. So, we, and, and of course, I said perfect in there too, uh, and we call this uh, uh, intro two. Okay. Mm -hmm. And there now we have intro and intro two. As I mentioned, those are available in the library. If I were to go to tools, I can go to the library and look, my intros are there. I could click on the plus sign and add that intro, add recording to episode, which means in my library I can have organized administrative pieces and things that I add to mm -hmm. each one of my episodes without having to take the time to re-record those every mm -hmm. time. But that's pretty sweet. That's pretty cool. So what we're going to do now is just simply drag and drop these into the place they should be in. Mm -hmm. And then the other thing that we could do here is uh, an outro. Mm -hmm. So we could have Veronica record that too. Uh, we won't have her record that for this episode, mm -hmm. but um, we've rearranged the segments. You see at the top it says rearrange segments. So we need to press save there. Now our episode's been saved. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and add a little bit of music before the intro comes in. And maybe... Mm -hmm. This maybe, is my favorite part. Yeah, maybe afterwards too, right? Mm -hmm. So let's go to... Um, in library in interludes here a little too country electronic folksy i'm very picky with my podcast i know ominous melancholy melancholic melancholy yes okay let's do with melancholy we have doghouse mm -hmm. oh this one's french yeah, yeah okay yeah, i like that so we'll go ahead and add that to the episode and let's also, while we're here, add another one to the episode for the outro of, the, mm -hmm. of this. Mm 
-hmm. Yeah, okay. Love it. So we'll add that to the episode as well. Now, if I wanted to, we could also, if you go over here to sounds, we could add sounds like a mystery sound. Like if you're about to start a segment, uh -huh. maybe that's a good thing. Let's just have a mystery sound or, or something. You can add this to the story when, when he's telling the story. Uh, these actually can't be added on top of it. It can oh. be added in between parts. Oh, okay. Yeah, but we can add that maybe before the interview. When mm -hmm. she said, let's get to the interview, right? Mm -hmm. um, so now if we go back to, we press X from any of these tools, because we're in the tools right now. Mm -hmm. X will bring us back to our episode. And you'll see that I've added these. So let's put the mystery, let's drag that up right before the, yep, right there, right before that begins. Mm -hmm. Let's put this as our intro music that actually starts the podcast. And then that's at the end of the podcast. Mm -hmm. Re we rearrange the segment, so we have to press save there. Now that we've done that, we can go ahead and publish this episode. And the episode's all done. Now, if we wanted to listen to this before we publish the episode, we could by pressing preview episode, that little button right there. Mm -hmm. So why don't we go ahead and preview the episode. Okay. And, um, what about the, the outro? And the outro is just going to be this. We're not going to record one for this video. Oh, remember? okay. Yeah. So let's go ahead and preview the episode. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Tango with Veronica. Tango with Veronica is a podcast about the beautiful dance of tango. So thank you so much for being here in Tango with Veronica. I know that you have an interesting story to share about how tango changed your marriage. Could you share that story with us? Yeah, I sure can, Veronica, and thank you for having me. So I was in a rough patch in my marriage. And and there you go. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, if we go out of the listening, there were times it's always a good idea to listen because you heard like pauses that were maybe a little too long. Mm -hmm. There's things we could have trimmed out of the intro and outro, but mm -hmm. we're going to call this good. And for the sake of this video, that shows you how you can get very creative, add a lot of different elements, a lot of different sounds mm -hmm. and music into your episode yeah i love the accessibility mm -hmm. uh how user friendly it is okay and now that we're satisfied with our episode we go ahead and say publish when we say publish this gives us an opportunity to add a title mm -hmm. we want to add a captivating title here um also we want to add a very detailed and thought out description. Yeah, descriptions are important. Very important. Um, they make they add searchability. They also tell people what the episode's all about. Mm -hmm. Also, we have the option to add a custom thumbnail specific to this episode. And if you're already using Canva, you know maybe you can create some type of a template that you just change up a little bit uh, for episode by episode. I think it's always an added bonus mm -hmm. to do that. If you choose not to do this. It will own, it will use your podcast artwork. Mm -hmm. And then here we have the option for season number, season one, and episode. This was episode two of Tango with Veronica. Mm -hmm. And an episode type. You have the choice between full, trailer, or bonus. We'll leave it as a full episode. And then we're all good to go. And when we're ready, we say publish now. You can also change the publish date. Mm -hmm. That allows you to publish it at a given time. So if you've edited, Also, you can schedule it. You can schedule oh. it to go out. So if you want your That's podcast That's a very to, nice feature. Yeah, it's really cool. So if you want your podcast to go out every Tuesday, then mm -hmm. you could change it for that. And we say publish date, and we're done. And there you go. I hope you found that very useful. Oh, and then one last thing is you can add up to five tags before mm -hmm. you actually go. You could skip this, but I wouldn't skip this. I would make sure you add tags like tango or um, dance or any of the tags you want. Mm -hmm. Add all five. Again, you want your podcast to be as searchable as possible. These tags will go into other directories, not just... Um, not just Anchor? Not just Anchor. Really? Uh -huh. yep. Wow. So we'll say done there. And then right now it's asking for a podcast name because Veronica's phone isn't set up on the podcast. So if this is your first episode, here it will prompt you through the process of setting up your podcast. Mm -hmm. We have another video that you can find right here. Make sure you go and check that out. That will show you how to properly set up your podcast and all of the things you need to do to get your podcast all set up onto Anchor and also how Anchor will help you to get your podcast distributed on all of the different podcast directories. And there you go, Podskis. I hope you found that information useful. If you have any problems or questions, you can leave them here on YouTube in the comments below. Hello. Or you can come find us on social media at Pod Sound School. And before you go, two things. No olviden hacer la tarea and don't forget to subscribe. Happy, Happy casting, casting, amigos!